open your mind. Hey out there, this is Buzz with the Survival Buzz. So it seems in a sudden change of events, the uh, House Speaker, Kevin McCarthy, was outed um, after basically trying to make a deal with Democrats on sending more money to Ukraine, which I think we all know what that is. That's just uh, lining some people's pockets at this point. Um, and like I've said all along, I have absolutely zero faith in the federal government. And even though it may appear that maybe some changes are happening for the better, I, I just don't buy it, man. Uh, it honestly makes me wonder what's going on. Uh, what are we in for at this point? Because every time there's a turn of events like this, something big happens, it seems like. And to that mention, like I've always said as well, if you really want change, it starts from the bottom. It doesn't start from the top. At the point we're at in the world right now, especially in the United States, the federal government is not going to help us. They're not here to help us, no matter how great it may appear, the House Speaker or the President or whoever, they're not for our best interests. If we really want change, it's got to come from the bottom up. And that starts with me and you, the people. The people are what control this government. It's not the other way around, even though the majority of people out there, I don't know, it seems like that's honestly what they believe at this point. But it starts with me and you. And I started this channel to help spread messages, to help talk to people, to help maybe possibly wake a few people up to the corruption going on in the world right now with all the uh, world governments and soon to be, I guess, one world government. But if you honestly think that a, you know, a few changes up top on the federal end is gonna change anything, you're crazy. These people, they're becoming millionaires off of us. You know, I find it funny, the salaries these people get going in, and then when they leave office, or oftentimes still in office, they're suddenly multi-millionaires somehow. And that should speak, speak loudly to every one of us that the corruption is very deep and all our tax money all our dollars all the stuff we work hard for is basically lining their pockets and making them more rich so if you want change it starts with us i started this channel i wish everybody would start a channel honestly the more voices the harder it is to shut us all down it's, it's harder to shut us up at that point um but that's what it's going to take you know Contrary to belief, and whether you believe it or not, the only thing the federal government fears is the people. And somehow we've gotten away from that over the years, and that's really something that we need to get back. So start your own channel. Spread the word, spread the message, share these videos out. You know, get involved in your local government, because that's where we're really going to make a difference right now. We're screwed federally. We are totally screwed there's not gonna be a president that comes in and saves us. You can hate me for it if you want, but that's my beliefs. And the only way we're gonna do it is locally. The only way we're gonna do it is to live in communities that support our values and beliefs and the way that we think the United States should be ran, not the way that the higher ups think it should be ran. But with the WEF, and all the, the UN and all those organizations and, and Agenda 2030 and all this crap, it's not going to stop. It doesn't matter who we have as president. The plan's going to go on. But how loud of a fuss are you going to make? Are you just going to sit by idly? Are you just going to sit on your hands and do nothing? Or are you going to stand up and be part of the change? Hopefully for the better, if we can get enough people to actually stand up. But start your own channel, man. Spread the word. Talk to people. Let people know you're sick of this because I'm sure they are as well. With that being said, if you guys are still here, I appreciate every one of you. Uh, this is my 200th video. And this day, two years ago, was when I started on YouTube. So get out there and get after it, people. 
I appreciate every one of y'all for being here. God bless y'all, and I'll catch you on the flip side. Later.